Today we've got the great pleasure of having Todd Horowitz with us, and he's going to give us some insights into the uh, what are the many uh, futures. With that, Todd, welcome to the Candlestick Forum. We're all anxious to see your information. Awesome. Great to be here, and thanks for having me, Stephen, and uh, the Candlestick Forum. Great, great to be with you guys, and what's up, everybody? Welcome aboard. Uh, we're going to go fast because we only have a limited amount of time, but we're going to crank it out. And uh, uh, this is my screen today. We're talking about managed futures, micros and minis with me, Bubba, and my name is Todd Bubba Horwitz. But before I can do anything, i got to show you the, the, the disclaimer, right? You can read it because me, I'm not a big fan, but they have there's risk and options and futures and the whole story. So you, you've got it in front of you. I'll give you another second or two to look at it. And uh, we're going to roll right on. And uh, this, I just got this in February 3rd triple of my futures account in 54 weeks. I'm looking forward to showing you some of the things I've been working on. Best piece of advice I ever heard is trade mechanically to remove emotion. And of course, no, no better day to be trading mechanically than a day like today or this week. But the first thing I always tell everybody, look, there, there's no magic box. There's nothing secret. Okay. We got it. We have a straight algorithm that works. It's, it's designed with the logic that I use on the trading floor and it works wonderfully. And you'll see the whole mix and you'll see all the results as of some of them as of today okay i will share everything with you but i, I don't believe in any of the, the magic that's out there and all the the stuff that you hear you read about and and all the the great promises when you're with me i tell it straight like it is and the first thing i want to tell everybody before we get started there's going to be drawdowns okay this business I, this business creates drawdowns there is no way that you can avoid them i don't care who you are or how good you are you can get drawdowns that's part of trading Okay, it's how you handle them and what you do with them, what makes it work, which is why we switched everything to, mag to, to, to um, mathematical and algorithm trading. So there is no emotion. You shouldn't be thinking about it. You should be following the rules. And, of course, the magic is inside you. There, there ain't no crystal ball. Okay, again, you got the magic. If you can handle it and do it, then you can be successful. If you can't, then you're going to struggle. That's just really pretty much that simple. So micro e mini futures, these are the next big thing. And, 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 you know, if any of you remember when the, CM, the CBOE tried to announce mini options, okay, they made a, a flawed error, the classic flaw, and they got greedy on commission, and they thought they could charge the same commission as they were charging for regular options. Well, that product flopped. But now the CME was smart. They said, okay, we're going to put this out, and we're going to give reduced commissions to the size of the contract. Well, guess what? They have done that this was their biggest launch of any products ever. Okay? That's how big these things are. And I personally believe that it's the next big thing in, in, in trading. I think that you can, you'll can you find there, there's great ease of operation. And one thing about the futures market, it's a pure price discovery market. It, there's, a, there's a bid and there's an offer, and there's no implied volatility to work or worry about. There's nothing else to worry about but exactly what it is. It's exactly a straight price discovery model with one tick wide markets and nothing to worry about about volatility collapses or anything that goes on it. And all we're playing is probability. Okay. Now, those of you who may play some games, you know, I'm a big game player. I love, I love gin. I love backgammon. I suck at bridge, but I like it. Uh, and, um, I like poker and I played, I played poker for a year in Vegas once. So, you know, for a year I, I lived there while I was trading. But in the meantime, those are all games of probability. Those are all games the better player is going to win. Okay? They're not going to win every time. They're not going to win every day. But they're going to have a mathematical edge over their opponent. And in trading, you're trading against an opponent, and you need a mathematical edge, which is what we have to offer. So just to give you a little introduction of who I am, and my name is Todd Bubba Horowitz, of course. I've been trading for 40 years. I've been a member of one of these Chicago exchanges for 40 years. I've been, I've been at the Board of Trade, which is really now the CME, but I've been there for the last... Uh, 11, 12 years, no, say 18 years, okay? I started the CBO in 1980. I founded Above a Trading. I've written two books on options, okay? And I've got one coming out on futures. I really contribute to all the major networks, including Kitco, Cheddar, and, uh, and Yahoo. I trade my, for myself and trade all my own recommendations, okay? There is, there is no special trades for everybody. I trade everything that I, anything that goes out of my office, I'm, I'm in it, okay? So just so you know that I, I believe in what I do, and I've done it for 40 years, so I'm happy about that. So we're going to talk about mechanical trading. And the major reason traders lose money in the long run is because they miss trades, let losses run in the trades they're in, and take profits far too early on the winners. That's a classic flawed error. It happens to everybody. 
because if you watched what's going on today, you saw they sold everything. Nobody kept any of the winners, but they, they, they dumped it all. I meant that as none of the three, therefore, our odds of winning are greatly enhanced and proven by real-time performance. We cannot miss a major move in any market. We do not let losses run. We always let the profit run. That is because the algorithm was designed to do exactly those three things. Okay. Now, you're trading trend trading. Now, if you remember, that you've heard the story about the turtles. Okay, you've heard of, you know, I happen, to be, I happen to be friends with Richard Dennis. I traded with Richard Dennis in the 80s in, 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 on the floor at the Seabow. That's where he started it. So, again, one thing we always knew is price is everything. Okay, I know we got the coronavirus. I know we got all these news items out. But as I contend, and I've said this on air, so I can I can show you the tapes. The markets were looking for a reason to break down. It happened to be the coronavirus that gave them their reason to go. You ignore the news. Okay, by the time you see news, it's you're you're about the one million person that knows what that news is. Just remember this: the big banks, Goldman, J.P. Morgan, they pay people millions of dollars a year to get that information first. So they're already in the market. The footprint is already starting to appear. If you hear it on the news, you're already late. Okay? You buy when a future breaks out of range, you sell when the trend changes. Pretty simple. Okay? You don't get out before a trend changes direction. Okay? You stick to the system. That, if you can do that, you're in great shape because then you're on your way to success because then we have long-term profitability because we know anything can happen day to day. Okay? Anything, there, there's no guarantee, as I said in the, in the third slide. There's going to be drawdowns. I'm, I'm going to promise you that. Okay? There's going to be drawdowns. So don't, again, this is not a magic. This is just simply using the tools that we have and knowing how to do it. We have a huge edge in the, in the way that we follow the trends because we do like none others. It's, it's, it's calibrated and figured out to, to get changing volatility. Everything that happens in markets, that algorithm has got built into it. And it doesn't take it long to adjust to new conditions. So we want to be successful. So we're going to use the algorithm for trading. So tonight, we're going to talk about what are our objectives, managed futures, it's the math, the portfolios, how you can take advantage, and of course, as always, I'll answer all of your questions, whatever they happen to be. Now, the system components consist of what? What markets? Well, we don't care. Okay? Listen, a chart is a chart is a chart is a chart. All markets are the same. All patterns repeat themselves. The, long, the shortest time frame always has to resolve backwards into the longest time frame. That's a decision size. We recommend everybody starts out with one across the board. Uh, I've got some guys now trading 15 to 20 contracts at a time now per product, and some of our models we trade up to 29 products at once. So, again, uh, entry, when to buy, when to sell. We send out our trades. I, uh, if, if there is a trade, I send it out at 3 a.m., okay, well before the market's open, okay, except that they do night trades. So if you want to trade them at night, you can. But at the end of the day, there is no day trading. There is nothing that happens uh, during the day. You have the trade, put it on, you set it, forget it, and you wait for the next signal. Okay? When we it stops out, when we close it, we never use stops. We close them out when it's time because again, our algorithms not that that far advanced. Okay? We we exit when to reverse in a webinar, and again, we we teach all that. But again, we know exactly what we're trying to get done. Okay? I can trade the markets without knowing the name. That's my friend Richard Dennis. Again, I can do it too because again. I'm a big believer in what they call universal price and all charts are the same. So we will always go by that because that's really what it comes down to. Now, rule-based trading. Why professionals, traders use rule-based trading systems? Because they work. Okay? We, we're not, I could care less of being right or wrong. And believe me, I've tried. There is nothing that you can tell me you've done that I have not already done. I have tried to predict. I've tried to, I've tried to do everything in the sun in markets. And always found a way, you know, I mean, it's some big winners, but I found ways to, to, you know, to throw a lot away by trying to be smarter than the market. Just remember one thing. The market is always right. If you think you are, you're wrong. And that goes into our rules. You must follow, okay? I mean, if you can't follow the rules, then there's no point in joining, okay? To win with algorithmic mechanical trading, you must have no opinions about the market. Zero done data. Okay? Again, you can have an opinion, but you better never trade from it. Okay? If you violate rule number one, you will lose money. A trend is the basis of all profit. You, you do not, if you do not understand this, you should not be trading. You pay attention to news, you will lose money trading. If you, for one minute, think you know more than the market, price is too high or too low, the market will take your money. It will always punish traders with such hubris. You will never sell at the top, nor will we buy at the bottom. That is a, for fools who insist on being right as opposed to be making money. 
the market is going higher and you are short, the market is right and, it, and you are wrong. The market is are long and the market is going down, you are wrong. The objective of mechanical trading is to mirror the market. You want to always be doing what it is doing, and if you do, you will put yourself in a high probability on your side. Trend mechanical trading gives you a statistical edge you cannot obtain elsewhere. Profitable traders understand that edges are essential in long-term profitability. That's how floor traders, that's how traders made their living. They had an edge. Okay. Again, from another one of my students, from the classes and training to your excellent algorithms, they give me the tools to be a successful trader. After 40 years of trying and failing, maybe now between your teaching and other technical analysis skills I've acquired along the way, it will work for me and I'll be able to trade for a living. Again, 40 years it took the guy to find me, but there he is. So we get into mini and micro futures. If you're familiar with the futures market at all, many people are afraid of futures, which is understandable. But again, futures, like everything else, has evolved. There is nothing to be afraid of. I've traded futures for 40 years. I traded the S&P when it was $500 before they cut it to 250 before they had minis. Okay. So again, it's, futures are great. They're a great product, but you start out if you're, you know, if you have some, 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 a little, you're trying to not get too involved right away. You want to learn a little bit. You start with the micros. The micros are one tenth the size of the normal contract. You can trade an S and P for a dollar twenty five a tick instead of twelve fifty. So again, it gives you an entry, and it also gives you a way to build a position as you build because we like to press our positions at certain times. So I will share with you what that is when we get there. But again, they're, they're a great product. They're extremely liquid, and they're out and ready to rock and roll. Okay. So what are our objectives? Well, make money is the first one, right? You're not here because you want to hear me talk. You want to make money. We like that. We try to keep the variance small. Like we know they're going to come. We're pretty. Our, our portfolios are very balanced. Okay, so we try to keep the drawdown small. Again, everything we try to do is, is obviously to protect our capital because at the end of the day, you got to protect your inventory, which is your money. Okay? So manage futures, okay, or following a trend. A good trend following system will keep you in the market until there's evidence that a trend has changed. And that's always important because, again, we don't want to be active. This is not to be an active trader, which is why we only issue trades in the morning once. And that's well before markets so that you have plenty of time to put your trades on or if you live in a different time zone. Everybody's got a chance to, to fire at the same time. Manage futures. Are, like, so we have some sample, you know, like in some of the portfolios, we've got everything, energies, metals, grains, softs, currencies, interest rates, and equities. Some we have a few that are, but, again, we have everything that's kind of blended to, if, if something goes wrong, to offset one another, again, to keep the variance and everything small. Another friend from our friend Richard, using mechanical system is the best way to consistently make money trading. You know that your system makes money over the long run. It's easier to take the signal and follow the system during periods of losses. If you rely on your own judgment during trading, you may find that you are fearful just when you should be courageous and courageous when you should be fearful. And again, has anybody ever done that before? I'm sure you have. Look, again, it, it takes a lot of corkles to stay with it when things are going wrong. Okay? But I'm just telling you that if you, if you take the edge, you've got it. Now, again, the family office, if, you've heard, if you know what a family office is, it's, it's typically for the very wealthy who you know, get some inside deals, like, you know, all the kind of stuff that we, the average guy, never get to. But this is the closest thing I've ever seen to creating a family office for the individual, one where you... You take care of it yourself, okay? But you get the opportunity to play in the market with big boys, and you get your or big girls. You get your opportunity to play in the game, okay? And uh, you you get that all with you, and so you get a lot of the same edge that they get. But you don't have to be you don't have to be a billionaire. Yeah, in California, that's fine because the trades will be there when you get up in the morning. So again, one thing about our trades, the entry time is not important. We're not looking for one or two ticks. Okay, every trade we put on is put on with the idea of hitting a home run. There is no one or two ticks. I, I've got a lot of people in California, okay, and they, when they get up, they put the trades on. Or they use, we've got a couple of places that do what we call letter direction trading, and they put on every trade at 6.30 a.m. Central Time, 7.30 Eastern. Okay, again, we love it. We loved when we created this, and, and everybody loves the philosophy and what we do here. So it's great, and again, it, it's giving you something that you have never had before, the opportunity to compete in the market with the, the people that you always envy. Are you ready for the next big thing? And of course, you are. And of course, if you're like, if you're a Seinfeld fan, 
That's gold, Jerry. It's gold. And one of the things that I've always done my entire life in the markets, in poker, is always playing the probability. Okay. I don't, I don't do anything without it being a high probability step. Now, I've done it in the past. You know, again, there's times I'll take a small shot. But I mean, in general, if I'm putting real money behind it, I do nothing. Okay. Without the probability on my side. Okay. And I use only mathematics and ideas because again, I put my trades on. I don't even check my portfolios during the day. I day trade as well, but my actual portfolios that we're going to see until there's, until there's a trade change, because again, if I'm not getting any new trades, if the system's not producing trades, then I'm making a lot of money because I'm not, I'm not wrong because if it was wrong, the, the, the system would be reversing and I'd be forced out. But so we like when there's very little activity, but sometimes, you know, we get some activity. Typically I'd say two, three, four trades a week at max. Reversal wise, you never know. But what we do have is we do have a 66% win rate. Okay. So, and why is it important? Because again, <clears throat> if you understand the win rate and you understand how you can then parlay, okay, your, your positions and get bigger and grow organically through the market. Because again, we're not interested in the guy who can come with the most amount of money and, and open up with big numbers. I love when people start very small. Okay. I've got one guy started with, with one contract years ago. He's up to 15 contracts per future in our big, in our, what we call our big boy, which I'll show you what it is, but it's, it's, it's a $226,000 portfolio and he's in it 15 times on 29 products. So again, pretty, pretty exciting, pretty interesting. But, you know, amateur traders want to be right. Pro traders want to make money. And I hope you're a pro trader from that standpoint. Okay. You want to make money. Okay. Again, I've tried to be right. It's been expensive lessons occasionally. Okay, I made some good money occasionally, but net net, you know, between all the inside tips I had back in the old days on the floor, and and all the gamble I took, I'd like to have the money back. Okay. Trading in a is a game of probabilities. You don't have to be right every time. You just have to follow the rules. And again, we're very big on rule following. And I can tell when I talk. And I do some training webinars during every month. I do a couple of webinars just to make sure everybody's understanding exactly what we're doing. And, uh, and we make sure, and I can tell, because I know exactly how the portfolios are doing, because AI traded myself, and I share those results every week with everybody. So, again, I know how they're doing. So if you say there's something wrong, I, I know that you're not following the rules. That's very important, because I always say you could publish rules in a newspaper, and no one would follow them. The key is consistency and discipline. Whatever you're doing, whether you come with me or not, these are the important things for you. Consistency and discipline. And understanding your win rate. That's... Those are the most important things you ever do. Okay, if you can understand that, you've got a shot to be a very successful trader. If you don't, you've got no shot. Okay? I knew I could not predict anything, but that was simply we, is why we simply decided to follow trends. That is why we've been so successful. We simply follow trends, no matter how ridiculous those trends appear at the beginning, no matter how extended or irrational they seem at the end. We follow trends. I don't believe that I am the only person who cannot predict future prices. No one can consistently predict anything especially investors. Price is not investors predict the future. Despite this, investors hope or believe they can predict it or the future or that someone else can. A lot of them look to you to predict what the next macroeconomic cycle will be. We rely on the fact that other investors are convinced that they can predict the future, and I believe that's where our profits come from. I believe it's that simple, as do I. And this is only John Henry, owner of the Boston Red Sox, who made enough money to buy the Red Sox. Okay. So again, we believe that wholeheartedly. There's nothing that I don't believe about that, okay? And that's how I trade it. Now, profit factor, if you know what a profit factor is, it's just simply defined as gross profits divided by gross losses, and that's all. And everybody raves if they have a two-to-one profit factor or a one-to-one profit factor. It's great, great, great. Well, we'll, well, there's times we will have well into the, the teens, sometimes in the 20s, as a profit factor, okay? So, again, this is this is the big boy, okay? This is one that, that this is not one you're looking at today, but this is just this is an idea of what we do, okay? It has 29 different products in it. And when you get this, and you get a report every Saturday morning. Members get the reports every, every morning. Every Saturday morning about 3 a.m. because that's what the, I get up at 2. I send out a report which shows all the trades, the entry date of that trade, okay, the performance, okay? And then if you see highlighted in the big portfolios, we consider a mega trade of $3,000 or more. Right now, and I'm going to show you this on live, this one is as of, this was actually as of this morning, okay, and it, and it killed it today, okay, just so you know, but 
this is as of this morning. This is this is as of this morning. These were our positions. Okay, short to almost the world, which obviously worked out well. 29 markets. Okay, eight losers, 21 winners. Right? Profit factor of 23. Okay, and now here, what you get from me in every portfolio is the results every week, winner or loser. Again, you'll see plenty of red in here, right? Again, I hide nothing. I give you the exact numbers. Okay, I give you a, an equity curve that goes with it. So this is this portfolio stands right here, right now. Okay, right now to, to today, it's, it's probably up over a hundred thousand for this week. Okay, again, that's unusual, but it, it, again, you can see the equity curve, right? We know. What do you know from that equity? When an equity curve like that, what do you know is coming? Does anybody know? Just out of curiosity, I know it's coming. Do you know what's coming next? Do you see an equity curve like that? I'd like to see if anybody knows. If you know, spit it, show it in the chat room. I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it when you know. So, in the meantime, okay, um, you get reversion of the mean. Yeah, you got it. There's a drawdown. We, I know there's a drawdown coming. There's not even a question about it. Okay, but I'm not going to worry about it today. Okay, how long do trades last? Well, let's look. I'll let you see for yourself. I'm going to show. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you one of my live accounts as well. Okay, so we'll find. We'll look together. Every day I send out a trade update. Okay. Hopefully I'm saying this one that says none, right? But if, like I said, 3 a.m. I send it out. Sometimes I send you a reversal, right? So reverse the Mark Swiss Frank in, in these two portfolios, 28K and 17K. Okay. So you get one of these from me every day, whether it's a trade or not. I either say none or I tell you what we're going to trade. Okay. So this was my own account. See, my name Todd Horowitz. I blocked out the account number just in case anybody cares. But this is my account. This was February 17th of this year. Okay. I had 22,000 account. This account started with 15. Now this is the 28K portfolio, which I would request and require you to have 28K in it. But since I've got so many futures accounts there, and I trade so many different portfolios, I just put this one in to really keep as a running sample for members and for when I do presentations. Because now, here it is today, same portfolio, it's got 45,000 in it. Okay. This is, I sent, I printed this report at 505 tonight. Okay. So here. So these trades opened. Okay. Um, actually, it's not on this sheet. It's on a different one. But again, so here's all the positions. In this portfolio, I think there's 28, excuse, 24 positions or 23 positions in here. Okay. All micros or minis. Okay. Uh, the equities, crude, natural gas, grains, notes, uh, currencies. Okay. And again, this portfolio is, is, is made three times since October. Okay. It started at 15,000. It got 45,000 today. Okay. But we know, we know there's a drawdown coming here too. But again, for now, I'm very happy. Uh, and again, if I just if I drag this one down for you, I'm going to show it to you. 28K. I'm going to show you the one that I had from Saturday because I don't have that one printed live yet. But here is this is from just this past weekend. Okay. And so here you go. So here we've been in one of these trades since two three since February third. Okay. And some of the trades are actually older than that. But when we get a rollover, like just now, we had to roll over all the indexes. Okay, you know they have they have. Uh, you can't see it. I can make it a little bigger. Uh, we get, we rolled over all the indexes. Okay, so what happens is is you have to roll from May, excuse me, from March to June. So all these Junes will probably open beforehand. Okay, so we have trades that lost last for an extended period of time. That's the objective. So in this portfolio. We have mega trades we consider $500 or more. Well, here you got a $3,300 one. Again, these are anomalies, but I, look, they are what they are. $850, $837, $64, $70, 10 year notes. Can you imagine? Okay. But in the meantime, here's all the information our entry date, our entry price, trade price. Okay. Here's everything tracked. And again, here is the profit factor. It's $894. It'll be higher this week. But again, it's $894 right now. 18 markets, 7 and 11, 7 losers, 11 winners. Average winners eleven twelve hundred dollars. Average losers two hundred seven. And here's all the statistics since its inception. This portfolio is up. It started in it started seven twenty six of this year, okay, of last year. Excuse me, of nineteen. Okay, it's up ninety three percent since the twenty sixth of July. Okay, there's all the statistics that are showing you. You get the, you get this each and every week. Okay? Again, another one. What do we expect? We expect a drawdown. But again, it doesn't matter. I don't care. I'm, listen. When it pulls back, when it reverses, I mean, all I'm going to do is press it up anyway. So it's okay because that when you get profitable, like I am in this portfolio, I'm going to pull it. I'm going to go ahead and print it, in, 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 but not before. And I don't press up in the middle of a trade. I will press when it comes back down to the mean, and that's exactly the best way to do it. Okay. All right. 
So, meantime. So, got to figure out what screen I'm on. Amazing performance on the managed portfolios. I just wanted to send you a note and thank you for your continued guidance in all asset investing. And I work very hard with everybody. We've got a chat room. Okay, we do a couple of webinars to make sure we're teaching. So again, your your, your questions don't go unanswered for more than four or five minutes. Okay, it's about it's, it's about futures, minis and make minis and micros. That's what it's about. Okay. It's about managed. You're going to manage yourself, but we just it's, we're giving you a portfolio. We're giving you the goods to put in the portfolio. You do the trading yourself, unless you want to use what they call letter direction trading, which we can we don't offer to you. But we have a source that we can offer to you. So we're happy. We're happy to do that as well, and I contend no one knows as to why markets do anything, and hence it is impossible to predict future prices with any consistency or accuracy. Those that think they can forecast are fools and will soon find themselves broke. Gurus con gullible traders into believing that they have some special knowledge of the future. Unfortunately, 99% of all trading is based on false promises, and this is why very few obtain large wealth from the trading game. You want to make money trading, you simply buy when prices are going up and sell when they're going down. It is, it is that simple and basic, but this concept evades most traders because they think they will make more if they know more. I contend the opposite is true. You, you can make more if you know less. Okay? That's what I contend. And, of course, just to share with you some of the portfolios, okay? so here is the ones you can look at. Now, the 17K, again, we go in the micro minis, we, we started a $5,000 portfolio which means that if you're using about $2,000 worth of margin, you put in five. We, we like to have three times the margin amount to make sure that you can, you can make it through any drawdown period. Again, we, we know the markets. We know what's going to happen. You know, if somebody gets in now and they start make, they get in all the portfolios right now, they're probably going to be for drawdown pretty sure. So, again, we like to make sure we have enough capital because emotions and capital are the things that, 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 that drive us. Okay? If your emotions get in the way, you got a problem usually. So, in the 17K, there's the uh, currencies, there's the, some of the indexes, okay? There is silver, soybeans, the franc wheat, so there's some things in there. Now, I can't tell you exactly what it is, but uh, you can share, I can share looking at it with you here. I mean, we show the, the, the max drawdown on this was probably about 6% six per, six possibly, okay? They're not typically too big. But again, it just depends. And but you get each and again each and every week you get every single again. I don't hide when it's a bad week. Okay? We, had, we did have we had, we had a ten percent drawdown early. Okay? I don't hide anything. I give you all details right for you, right in front of you. Again, I don't believe in anything else. I believe in being straight. This has got a profit factor of twenty-two. Okay, you know, fifteen markets, three losers, twelve winners, and again. A couple of mega trades here as well. Now, this one doesn't have the notes, and it doesn't have oil. So, again, but it's got obviously some nice winners just the same. And you can see we are short the market. Okay. So, again, this is – and then there's the, the, the 5K. Okay. Again, that's, the, that's the, the starter model or the entry model for those. Again, depends on your – it's all up to you. You can always switch. You, you, each and every week, you get them all. Okay. I send you – all portfolio, all the four portfolios, you get them. You can make your choice from there. I don't. Again, I'm on your side. I want you to do whatever you can do. Now, this one had had a drawdown, made new highs, had a drawdown, made new highs, and has a drawdown. Now, obviously, this week it's much it's higher. And this is as of last Saturday. It is now short, 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 short. Okay, it's short. It short the world again. This is from last Saturday, so they hadn't changed yet. They changed on Monday. Okay. In the meantime, again, here's the equity curve. Here's all the information. You can, you can track it. You can watch it. Okay. Again, there's no. I have no secrets. I'm 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 fully in belief that everybody should be fully informed of everything they're doing because at the end of the day, I'd want to be fully informed. And I wouldn't want anybody to, to pull the wool over my eyes. And then we have the, the 16K, which is a beast. Okay. For, for a little portfolio, this is, this, this baby is just it just it just nailed it. Unbelievable. Okay. I mean this this portfolio is. Has gone basically, you know, straight up, and it just continues to make money. And again, you get the stats here. This is this is up 508 percent, okay, 508 percent. So I mean, again, these are real numbers. These are real portfolios, because uh, that's what we do. Okay. I mean, again, I'm not interested in, in anything else. 
How much you can start with? 5,000 would be the smallest I'd want you to start with and go in the 5K portfolio. Um, whatever the max run. Again, max run has been, you've seen, there's been one in here that was, I think, 15%. Okay. Or was it? Oh, not this portfolio, the, the other one. I mean, again, it doesn't matter. That's, that's why we start with enough margin. Again, if you can, if you can follow the rules and you can control yourself, then you're going to make a lot of money. That's, that's that simple. If you can't follow the rules, you're not going to make money, but you won't make money anywhere. Okay? That, that, that's unfortunate about the, the business is that, you know, many could do it, but again, you, you can't, if you can't follow rules, it becomes a much bigger challenge to those. But again, we show you everything. There is, there is no secrets for me. Okay, here, this one I think here, here 17%. Okay? But it was after a brand new high. So again, it depends where they come in and it depends on where you are, but that's what we look at. This can be auto traded if you want. That's it's entirely up to you. I have a place that works with us that handles most of them, and you're I'm more than happy to give it to you if, if you'd like that. Again, I'm for whatever makes it easier for you. Okay. To me, when you're auto trading, it makes it easier because you don't make any mistakes because you're you're part of a group order that you know they're all going at the same time. So, but again, I don't care. I, I have no whichever way you want. There is no setup. It's an algorithm. I can't. There's nothing to show you. I'd be happy to show you any chart. I'm one of the best chart readers there are, but I've got news for you. Some of the trades the algorithm makes that turn out to be the biggest winners, I, I wouldn't have been in myself by looking at the chart. That's all I can tell you. Okay. Uh, I mean, I made them. They're pretty big here, but again, I'm sorry. I, I wish I could. I wish I could make them big. Is, I try, is that bigger? Can you read that better? I'm happy to help if I can. Okay. Let me know if that works out better. I don't know. I'm happy to, to share it with you. Okay, um, but there is no setups. Okay, the rules are very simple, and I give them to you. Okay, you follow them. I, I, I give you a quick review of them right now. Okay, figure out what I'm doing here. The rules are very simple. In McAndre, no opinions. If you violate number one, you lose money. A trend is based on all profit. If you do not understand it, you should not be trading. If you pay attention to the news, you will lose money trading. If for one minute you think you know more than the market, price is too high or too low, you'll lose money. Okay, the market's always right. right? Um, we never sell at the top, nor do we buy at the bottom. Again, we miss the top of the range because we're, we're not going to sell too early, and we miss the bottom uh, because we can, we're not going to buy too early. We need proof, and the algorithm proves it. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry if you think it's poor. My, my bad. You know, again, I can't tell you. I apologize. If the market is going higher, you're short. If the market is going and you're short, you're wrong. If it's going down and you're long, you're wrong. Pretty simple. Okay. Please put. Please, please Phil, can you use the icon to the left in the market? Oh, you're not doing that. Uh, the objective of mechanical trading is to mirror the market. You want always to be doing what the market is doing. If you do, you will have the high probabilities on your side. Trading mechanical tra trading mechanical traders. Gives you a statistical, a statistical edge. And over, all, listen, my whole life in markets, all I want to do is be able to create the edge. That's, that's what we did. And we have a 66% win rate. That's a fact. Okay? That's exactly what we have. 66%. And, and that, that's a real number. Okay? And again, you get every week, you get the results. So it's, it's not like, it's not like I'm going anywhere. Right? I've been in this business for 40 years. I ain't going, I ain't going anywhere now. And I'm, I'm, I love the business, and obviously I'm not going to do anything else. Uh, so if you'd like to join me, you can. Okay. Um, today I've, I'm offering a special, and of course our futures portfolio management is 129 a month. But for the for tonight special, okay, you the first two months for one month. You can try it for two months. Okay, you can continue at 129 a month after. Okay, and if you want to try it that way, it's bubbatrading.com forward slash special. Or if you want to go annual, for the first year, I give you 13 months. Give you the baker's dozen. Okay. That'd be BubbaTrading.com special year. Okay. Uh, now, I understand you, you, you focus on, on how to, but again, we have, I have an algorithm that, that works. That's, that's the how to. Okay. I would love to, I would love to give you more, but there, but there is no more. I mean, I will show you this. But I can't show it to you. If I could. I, if I had a, a place to put it on. If I was familiar with the system enough, but. I get a report from a couple of people every day just to make sure that everybody's in line and doing what they're supposed to. So here's a guy who trades the 28K, okay, 20K portfolio. I think I'll put in the chat room. I'll check it through that. Yeah, I can do that. Here's, 
here's something. Now, this is this is based on two contracts, so you know. Copy. This is what's his date today. I'm going to put it in the chat room. Okay. Paste. Send. Okay. That's what this guy did today. Okay. He sends me every day. He sends me a report. How uh, we did. So, again, you want to join me, it's bobatrain.com forward special. And, again, I will answer any question that you have. Um, I'm sorry you're no wiser, right? This was to, to help you make money, but I'm, I'm sorry you didn't learn anything. The base of the algorithm is the time, price, volatility, all the things that you look for when you're reading a chart, except that this is faster, better, and, more, and, and it takes away all the thought process. There is no decision making. You're either long or you're short. The algorithm says you're either long or you're short. There's nothing else to look for. Hey, that's great. It's good for you. I'm, I'm happy. Look, at the end of the day, whether you come with you or not, it's not a big deal. I want you to be happy. I want you to be successful. That, all I care about is that people are successful. That, that's, that's my number one goal in life. I've done extremely well in my, in my 40 years of trading, and I hope that you do as well. Okay? I hope you do 10% as well. Okay? Because it's, it's been a great run for 40 years. So I'm, I'm thrilled that you can do it, and God bless. It's great. Okay? If you automate it, simply I will give you the broker. You will arrange with them and have what they call a letter of direction. Okay? And that letter of direction will empower them to trade only this portfolio. Okay? You know, they're another broker. Like, you know, they, 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 they use uh, uh, RJ O'Brien. Okay? But they're another broker. You can trade an IRA account 100%. Okay? I've got probably 50 people using trading in an IRA account. Okay? So, yeah, we, we're, we're all set for anybody. Anybody and everybody who wants to play. And listen, we have, we have lots of members and lots of people that are happy and, and, and they don't leave. So, again, uh, I'm, I'm happy because, you know, it's nice to have 90% retention. So, so, it's all good. You know, again, I want you to be happy, whether it's with me or not, no problem. The IRAs do allow short futures, yes. Okay. Yes, 100%. Okay, you can trade an IRA there, 100%. Okay. We have. I told you I got 50 to 100 people trading IRAs now. Okay, I have my I, I, one of my accounts is in IRA, 100. percent You can use IB. You're going to have to use IB because I remember you, Johnny Mac. You're from Canada. Okay, you can't use my auto trader because a they don't go to Canada because Canada makes it so hard to do business. Right? An IB broker would be who I would recommend because they're at least at least expensive. Okay, that's you know again. Yeah, I can't. I can't offer you other things. I don't charge commissions. They, the broker charges commissions. It's about, I don't know what they charge for letter direction trading. It's you know, it might be ten dollars or whatever it is, or eight dollars. I mean, it's a little bit more than if you're doing it yourself. But again, we're not active. So in in this game, when you're trading commissions and you're trading actively, like in my futures account today, I traded six hundred futures. Okay, so that was if I was paying a lot of money, I couldn't afford it. Okay, I don't pay a lot, so it, it works, out, works out fine. But, you know, I'm used to being on the floor and, and trading, you know, 50,000 contracts a day, which I've done. But, you know, again, there we were maxed out in commission after, after uh, we paid 100,000. Okay, and that was usually by April. So, in the meantime, um, their price is very much in line for an auto trading service. They're unbelievable. They take care of you. And when you get a problem, if you have a problem, you call them up. There's no voicemail. They answer the phone. So, again, it's, it's a great service, and in this model, commissions are not an issue because we're not active, okay? Again, I'm telling you, I hope we don't have a trade. I hope I don't have another trade for six weeks. Of course, I know there will be one, but I'm hoping there won't be, okay? Um, is there extra charge? I mean, it's, it's they charge, like I said, it might be, you might be able to do it yourself for four or five. I think they charge eight to ten, okay? But, again, honestly, because that's a big part of what I talk about, and for those who are active, okay, commissions are a big part of liquidity. In this case, they are not because we don't trade off enough. The average return per year is, is probably 60, 70, 80%. I mean, again, I'm not going to promise you 250% per annum. I, I don't, I mean, could it do it? Yeah. I mean, the, the 16K did that. But again, I'm not, if you're looking for, if I, if that's, the, if, if I have to make that promise to you, then I'm going to say no. Okay? Because I, I want you to come in knowing that you're going to make money. Now, again, if you just look at the, the equity curve, I'm, I'm, well, we'll look at the big boy just because it's got the, it's got the most time logged. 
which is why I show you that one. Not not because it's any better or worse because of the size of the contract. But let me just show it to you because again, the the big boy. Where are you? Where'd you go? You disappeared. Uh, this is there. You go. No. That's, sorry, I'm I'm, unfirm, I'm in uncharted territory. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm looking for. So I, I got to. I just grab it. E easy enough to get again. So again, I, I, I will not promise any results. I'm going to tell you that you're going to have the edge trading and that we do have drawdowns. And, and if they're all the bad stuff, you can make up your mind on the rest. I, again, I'm not, I'm not a guy that's going to promise you everything. I mean, here, this thing, this portfolio was made, started, started in November of 16. This portfolio was made five, 610% okay, since November of 16. Those are running results. Right? Here's the exact equity curve. Now, again, it went through a long period of consolidation, just like a chart. Okay. Looking at this is like looking at a chart. So I know when it gets up here, it's probably going to start to draw down a bit. And, of course, it did. When it gets up here, it's probably going to come down. And when it gets up here, I know it's coming down. But, again, I'm just looking, I'm just chomping at the bit to buy more, so I don't care. Okay? Because I want to be. These are long. They're, they're not swing trades. They could be, again, we were, we, but we were long the NASDAQ last year for the entire year, basically. So again, I, can, I we've been in a trade for almost a year that just kept going in our favor. So again, we don't get out until the trend changes. We just turned short the Monday, this Monday. Okay. It's been a nice trade too. It's up about eleven thousand already. Okay. So again, my point is is that I'm not going to make falsely promises. I showed you exactly the results I have. I showed you my portfolio. Okay. And again, if you want to be into algorithm trading and you want to be in something that you don't have to think about, that everything is automatic, and you just make your entries once a day if there is any, then great. I would love to have you aboard. If, if that's not for you, hey, I understand. I got no worries, man. I'm, I'm I'm thrilled to have you know people come aboard because I teach. I'm good, and we we got a great system. Okay, and I do do webinars teaching some other things as we're going. But again, my focus and my whole direction is to get everybody into mechanical trading because, in my opinion, it's the best. And then you can go out and play golf and do what you want to do because you're not going to change. You're never going to miss a trade because it's never going to change during the day. Okay? That's, that's what I do. So if you want to join me, you know, it's bubbatrading.com forward slash special. Or if you want to come for the year, special year. If you don't, hey, I appreciate you spending your time with me. I mean, again, I'll answer any questions you have. Uh, in the meantime, I, I finished a little fast because I, I, I knew I was up against the clock, so I finished faster than even I thought. But I mean, if you want to look at a chart, I'll show you how to read a chart. I mean, listen, I've been doing it for, well, actually, when I first started, we didn't read charts because when you're on the floor, there's no time to read a chart. You're trading paper. Okay. But I mark, listen, I, I do every Monday night, you guys get, you get part of this. You get to come to the Monday night call, which I break down a bunch of stocks and some futures. But again, I, you know, we were, we, we bought Apple, okay, at 204. We just got short uh, at about the 310. Okay. So, you know, we have a nice little run there as well. Again, I know how to read them, so you know I do it all the time. I just use my I use what I've learned over over 40 years in this business. Okay, you know I trade from here. This, this is a blow off pattern, and this is what Steve was kind of. You're going to get a you're going to get a major rip your face off rally, but it may not be tomorrow. It will be out of nowhere, and it'll be hard. It'll be fast, and it'll fail at some point. But again, that's what you can expect from this kind of market right now. This is a all blow off. I actually trade this pattern. Out of four minutes time frame. That's what, I, that's what I do. I trade, when I'm trading actively, I'm trading in four minutes. So right here, I, I mean, I wasn't trading, but this is what, I've been looking for a potential buyer right there. After it confirmed, so I, would probably, I wouldn't have bought down here. I probably would have bought somewhere. Again, I'm just guessing right now because we didn't make the trade, but somewhere right around there. Okay. In the last few days, well, we got short all the indexes on Monday. Okay. We got short all the indexes, the Dow, the Russell, the S&P, and the NASDAQ Monday. Okay. Um, what else we do? Actually, I can show you the dates. Hold on. I can tell you exactly what we do. Hold on. Hold the wire. I can show you exactly what we're looking at. I can find that one again. I probably can't because, you know, I'm not good at, I'm not good with computers, except for 
and the algorithms. I can't. Uh, but I mean, have we made what, what else we do? This would be all last week. So last week we bought corn, which we're going to reverse that. It's going to be a loser. Okay. Um, we bought. Uh, we we shorted the euro currency. It's been a nice winner. Okay. Again, these are all the dates. You know, and again, I, I don't know exactly, but uh, I, I know we've done you know a number of trades. You know, we've done three or four this week. It is being recorded. Yes. Okay. I like to trade fast. You know, if I'm trading, if I'm using my tools, okay, um, if I'm using my tools that I can use, which I'm a good trader then I want the most amount of opportunities I can get. I'm playing one pattern when I'm playing short term. I'm playing the blow-off pattern. I'm playing the panic pattern, right? How do you identify that? Well, certainly you identify it by big volume, big price movement. And, of course, I'm going to go against that move, okay? But it's got to be, the setup's got to be right, okay? It's got to be very heavy volume. Let's see, if we, let's see if I can find one that I actually made today. I mean, I'd be happy to share it if I do. Well, actually, I, I, I did, okay? Um, I did buy them here. Okay, I did buy this this move here. Again, they're not all winners, but again, I did buy here. Okay, uh, and, and of course, I sold. I did sell this one. All right, but again, you see the unusual volume. That's that's a, 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 a trigger point. Okay, uh, I trade everything, but uh, futures are. I will say this: futures are the best trade there is. There is no implied volatility. There is no explosion where volatility is now. The VIX is now at what sixty-seven or something like that. Okay, seventy-five. Sorry. I mean, this is the highest it's ever been since uh, since uh, uh, 08, and it's the highest. I traded when it was 140, 150. In, I was in the, on the pit in, in 1987, the OES. Okay. So I'm a very good options trader. But, again, for, for futures, for trading, there's nothing like futures. Okay. Again, you, everybody has their own preference. I don't tell anybody what to do. Okay. I, I'm, again, I'm, uh, there's no money back. You get two months for $129. If you want it, great. Again, look. At the, at the end of the day, again, I, I'd love to have you, and you'll learn a lot. But if you don't want to come, I'm not, I don't want to twist anybody's arm. I don't want anybody to try something they're not comfortable with. Again, I've got plenty of business, okay, and I'm happy, and I enjoy what I do. So, and I teach good. I'm a good coach. And again, I'd love to have you, but I, I don't want anybody to, you know, to feel compelled. If you, if you believe what I got to tell you, then you're going to be, you're going to want to be a member. If you don't believe what I got to tell you, then you don't want to be a member. You know, I don't want to promise anything. I've already told you that there's drawdowns are part of the business. And I'm not going to change that. Okay? You know, I, somebody asked me you can make 250, 250. It's possible, but I'm not going to promise that. Again, I make money. My people make money. They love it. Okay. Again, I can show you. I can show you 50 emails from today. Okay, of people that are thrilled out of their mind for how much money they're making. But again, I don't. I, I want you to be able to say, hey, this looks like it's what I want to do. I want to be more passive. I want to sit in some positions. I don't want to deal with, you know, the market every day. Okay. That, that's look at that. That's that's your decision that you get to make it is what you feel like doing and, and where you want to be out here. So I can give you a trade. Somebody asked me. So I, I knew I wanted to find it. So this week uh, on 311, we shorted the Japanese yen. On 310, we shorted the NASDAQ, British pound, and the Swiss franc yesterday. That, that U.S. dollar, we got long yesterday. Bonds, we got short yesterday. So that, that's our trade for all, all, all week so far. That's, a new, that's the stuff that was new. Again, again, like I said, I'd love to have you come aboard. I mean, you get to see all the stuff that I do, and you get to participate in some other things that I do. But again, if it's not for you, it's not a, no worries. Man. I'm, I'm, I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled to have a, to have a chance to talk to you. Because so four minutes, just I want as many opportunities to create trades as I can. I actually have, I've actually got 32 charts up above, all in four minutes. So when I'm trading, I don't need to see the charts. Yeah, uh, first thing only, if just something you can learn. The first thing I'm looking at is this window here. Okay. If there's no action here, then it doesn't matter. There, there's no, if there's no, no, if there's no flashing lights here, there's no blow-off pattern appearing. So I don't have to worry about it. So I, I watch this first. And as it starts to get flashy, then I'll start looking at, at the chart. Okay? Um, you take every, if you don't take every trade, I don't want you to sign up. Okay? Please do not. This is a, you trade the model or don't. Please do not sign up if you're not going to trade the model. I'm telling you now, I don't need anybody that's going to create a headache for me because, again, you're going to find out that you cannot predict the market, which is why we trade a balanced portfolio because, again, we hit 66% of those trades, and that's what we do. So I don't want you to believe 
that you can outpick which one is better. If I knew which one was better, I'd never take a loser, would I? Okay. I do trade options. Yes, I actually get. I created this model in an option model, but again, I'm just telling you outright, straight up. This is pure. It's cleaner. It's easier. Yeah, but again, I have the same thing in options as well. You want that? You can have it. I mean, again, I do the same thing in options. I just, I just prefer futures. It's just again, it's a lot cleaner for the individual investor. That, that's what it comes down to. I don't deal with volatility. Um, the best account size. Well, actually, the 16 has been on fire. I mean. The, the, the 16, 17, 28 are all, they're all about equal. The 28 has just the most amount of products. You know, I like the 28 because it's well diversified. Okay. So I like the 28. Okay. I have my account, I've got three major ones other than my IRA. I've got the, the 28, which I showed you. I've got the 226, which has multiples in it, right? I have more than one contract. And I have what I call the hybrid. I have a one that, see, I have two of them auto traded. And I just opened the third one to be auto traded. So I don't, I don't deal with them. I don't look at them. And I have one that I trade, not actively, but I, I do. I got more combinations of stuff in there, right? I just it just keeps me busy, okay? If I'm not day trading, okay. So I like the bigger ones, but again, it doesn't matter to me. I, I my 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 biggest thing for you is to come and join me and get a little bit of experience, and then you'll figure it out. Again, I'm happy that somebody starts at any price because you see right away that I'm telling you straight, exactly what I told you now is going to happen. You're going to have drawdowns, you're going to have big wins, and you're going to find out that the equity curve is going to continue to go higher, which is all we care about. Okay. Your example of trade, I well, yeah, I, I did show it, but here, here's the trade. I mean, here's the, here's the whatchamacallit. This is what I send every day, every morning. At about, it'll be in your inbox before you get up, most likely, unless you're nuts like me. Okay. I send out this, and it says either new trade, none, or new trade, and it gives you the actual trade. Every morning, about 3 a.m., they get sent. Okay, so again, I'm I'm on top of it all the time. You know, I don't run the algorithm till later, anyways. So again, I'm looking to do what's best for you. Okay, um, my algo generated all the trades. I don't. I there is no human intervention in this model. Okay? I do not. In, look, sometimes look. First of all, I, I do daily update, which, uh, daily updates. I do a video, five-minute video every day, telling you what's going on in the markets about noon Eastern. Um, and, and I also text my subscribers as well during the day, give them a little update of the markets. But in the meantime, at the end of the day, um, there's, everybody knows that I hate being long oil. I hate it. Okay? It's, I, it's, I, hate long, I hate oil and I hate bonds. I, I always think they're going lower. But again, I trade exactly as the model dictates. Okay? Well, fortunately enough for me, or, or lucky enough for me, Lucky enough for me, or, or fortunate enough for me, okay, is when we bought, we bought crude, okay, we bought crude, right up here and show you. Chart, okay, so we bought crude, and you, you, you won't believe it. I hated every minute of it, okay. We bought crude, okay, and I hated every minute of it, and we were long crude right here, okay, and I kept whining and whining and whining, and then of course we had that big, that big deal that went down and the crude better blow off up and we made a lot of money, right? And then we get short. Okay? So then we, were, we we came down, we got short, made money, then we get long again, and again, up, oh, I got another big move. God bless America, I loved it. I hated it. I whined every day about it on my update. And then of course we got short right around here. Okay, we're still short. And of course on Sunday night we got that that twelve dollar down move. It done didn't hurt, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, so again. That, that's that's you know what we do I, again. I don't I don't. There's not one ounce of my opinion there. I have an opinion. I would never uh, trade to it. Though. Not in this model. Well, this is TOS. But again, I don't. It doesn't matter what I use. I can use anything. Okay. I just the reason I always have TOS up there is because I got. Um, what's your question? What, what, what I don't have a trade yet. I mean, I, I just showed you the kind of trade we do. That's how you get them. What, what, how, you, you want me to show you how I get to the trade? Is that what you're asking? Okay. Is that what you want to see, how I produce the trade? I'm not sure. Maybe I didn't understand. Okay. I mean, you want me to go through the chart and say this is why we got here? If that's what you want, I don't know. Again, it's run by totally by mathematics. There is no, there is no opinion in here whatsoever. I don't even look at the chart. I just run the program. Okay. Again, I've got a program that's been working like a champ for years. 
I've been using it for about 12 years. So, again, I just decided to bring it to market in the original portfolio brought the market in November, which is the result you guys get to see. You, there's no results posted that have not been able to be used or being achieved by any of our people that are members. Okay. Um, well, I mean, Dr. Fang, myself, you know, again, there's a certain trading logic that you have to understand about markets in general. Okay. Well, being a floor trader, I had all the logic. I knew it. And of course, between that and the math and the numbers, and you know, we put together a nice little again, it's a nice little program. I get again, it's not for sale. Nobody knows it, but me and one other person. And first, uh, you know, it'll it'll go it'll go. It, it, it's the the information's in the safety deposit box, okay, uh, for my son. Should something ever happen to me, but at the end of the day, I mean, you know, again, I've licensed out a couple times, which I do, okay. I mean, everybody wants it. I just won't. I'd never give it for them. Uh, so, Zeke, I don't know your questions, but if you want to ask me, I'll be happy to answer. I, mean, I, I, mean, I can't show you how I got a trade. Bye. Uh, you know, if I could show you, I would show you. But, I, again, produced by an algorithm, so I had nothing to do with it. Uh, there's no trade last night. How, uh, last few nights would be good. I mean, we're short. Listen, you saw what I made today. I showed you. The numbers. I mean, I'm, this is this is live. This is my live account. This is not uh, garbage here. March 12th, 28k portfolio. Okay, we're short everything. We're dead on mar we're we're dead on the mar markets. Okay, so I, what can I tell you? This is here it is. Anyway, and I've been down too. But I showed you I, in in February it was 22. In March it's now 45. That that's again that's what the, that's what I have. Okay, I can I show you anything. I don't I don't have any secrets. I send his results all the time, okay? and I don't worry about the night stuff. I, I like I like when it's busy because I trade. I listen. I get up at you know uh, this week. I've been getting up at like midnight so I can go trade. Okay? We do, we use no stops. The market will turn and change. That will stop us up. Okay? Yeah, there's no we, we use no stops. Okay? Uh, you use one contract unless you want to use more. That is entirely up to you. I prefer everybody starts out with one. I don't want people to get, again, what I'd hate to see happen is somebody come in guns a blazing and fire everything in and then we go right into a drawdown. Okay. Again, I, I know it's coming and I tell you right away, it's, we're going to see drawdowns. So I don't want anybody to fire in right away. It's not, it's not what we want to do. We want to make, I want to make sure that you can exist and learn and be here so, and get paid. That, that's what my goal is. Okay. Like everybody else, again, I don't lose that. People don't quit me. Okay, because what I got is gold. It is it, it is the real deal when it comes to this business. Okay, no thought. You don't have to think about. It, you know, there's no trades during the day. There's nothing where the fills don't matter. Okay, well you miss it by a little bit because every trade is designed to cash a mega trade. Okay, now they don't always get there, and sometimes they're losers. But at the end of the day, that's the objective of the system: to hit home run. That's what we're trying to do. So, end game is. It's about you. I care about you. I want you to be good. In the meantime, you're welcome to come and join me. And if you want to email me, bob at bubbatrading.com. And if not, hey, it was great to be with you. I'm glad to spend an hour with everybody. And I always appreciate the, the time to share because uh, I do love coaching. And even from, from little kids to in baseball to adults in um, in uh, trading. And, of course, I'm bummed out with no no NCAA, no March Madness, no NBA, no baseball. It's going to be a long summer that we get this thing going. In the meantime, I thank you all very much for listening. If you have any more questions, please uh, let me know. And at the end of the day, thank you.